Welcome back to Casting High School for tonight's varsity matchup between the Kings of Lewis Cast and your Casting Comets. Now let's meet tonight's starting lineups. First for the visitors on the scoreboard, the Lewis Cast Kings. Up first, a 6'2 sophomore, number zero, Trey Johnson. A 6'3 junior, number three, Bryce Rudd. A 5'10 sophomore, number five, Brennan Deaver. A 6'4 senior, number 21, LJ Hillis. And a 6'1 sophomore, number 24, Brody Hillis. The Kings are coached by Eric Brown. For tonight, up first, a 5'11 senior, number four, Talon Tiger. A 6'3 senior, number five, Frank Gayton. A 5'11 sophomore, number 10, Gavin Mullenkopf. A 6'1 senior, number 11, Caleb Stinson. For tonight's contest, Kurt Robinson, Tim Smith, and Steve Godfrey. All right, we are underway. Opening tip going to Lewis Cass. Hillis has it, top of the key. Johnson. LJ Hillis now. Down into the post. There, we're going to get a charge. It's another game where Grant Yaden takes a charge. And that is 24, Brody Hillis, his first. Team first, and that dubious honor of game first. Not a good way to get your first turnover of the game. Comets working the offense. Stenson has it. He'll dump to Zyder. Zyder drives, kicks. Molenkoff has it. Molenkoff is going to get trapped. He sends the Zyder. Zyder three. Just a little short. It's going to be out of bounds. Great work by the Lewis Cast defense there to box Zyder out to not have a chance to save that rebound. That was a great play though off of that off of that trap for Molenkoff to feed Zyder. Zyder really quick to release that three though. Defense watching that and obviously scouting shows Zyder as a shooter. Now Kings into LJ Hills in the paint. He's gonna kick it down low. Johnson, Johnson puts it in for two. Stenson brings it up for the Comets. Hook, Zyder near wing. Molenkoff has it. Molenkoff trying to find an open man. He'll find Zyder near side. Post pass goes off of Yaden. Couldn't hold on to it. So far, Comets, two possessions, two turnovers, only one attempt on basket. Those kind of numbers can't, can't stay if they want to have a shot in this game tonight, Pete. Not at all. Johnson dishes to Hillis. He'll dump to Rudd. Now to Johnson, back down into Hillis, and it's going to be a foul on Molenkoff. Molenkoff picking up his first, team first. Hillis inbounds to Hillis. Yaden tips it. 
It'll be a loose ball. Yaden's going to come down with it. Stinson brings it up. He'll drive. Shot fake. Puts it up and off the mark. We rebounded by Young Rudd. Rudd's going to take it. Dish to LJ Hillis. He'll drive. Kick it to Rudd. It's going to be out of bounds. Rudd couldn't hold on to the pass from Hillis. Sending it out of bounds. Just over two minutes gone. Lewis Cass Kings, 2-0 over the Comets. Zyder bringing the ball up. Stenson near wing. He's going to kick to Yaden, top of the wing. Yaden missed uh, Hook down low. Molenkoff has it. He'll give it back to Hook. Post pass is going to be a foul on Brody Hillis there. That'll be his second, team second. Colton Young checks in along with Alex Craig. Stinson gets the inbound, he'll give it to Hook. Craig, Stinson. Stinson looks to pass down low. It's gonna be stripped by LJ Hillis. Now King's gonna bring it down quickly. Top of the key, Dieter puts that in for three. Five minutes to go, scores five nothing. Lewis Cass Kings lead. Yaden has it. Hook drives, puts up a shot, that one's in for two. Little floater there, falls for Lane Hook. Young has it far side, he'll dump down to Hillis. Hillis puts that in for two. Got an easy open lane to the bucket there. Definitely a defensive miscommunication as Hillis just spun, took the paint and went. Yaden has it, he'll give it to Craig. Craig, Zyder, Zyder to Stinson. Thomas looking for an open look down low. Zyder has it near wing. He'll dump it down to Yaden. Yaden, hook shot. That one's in. Comets finding a couple open looks now. Looks like they're starting to pick up their tempo. Or, or find their tempo. Johnson gives it to Rudd. Or out to Young, out to Rudd. Dieter shot off the mark. Hillis with the rebound. He'll put a shot up and he'll be fouled. Shove there on number 12, Alex Craig, his first, team second. Hillis, first free throw, up and good. Number 14, Wade Taco is going to enter. Hillis, so far tonight, two shots, two makes. Starting to see who the shooters are early. There's a second free throw and that's in. Nine to four with half of the first quarter gone. Kings lead. Craig has it near side, he'll dump the hook. Hook down low to Yaden, Yaden shot fake. He's gonna get fouled going up for it. Foul there on number two, Colton Young. His first, team three. I gotta tell you, I don't know who that would have hurt more, an elbow to the head, the receiver or the giver. First free throw just short. I think the, the person getting elbowed in the head would probably be in a little bit more pain. <laughs> Carter Klingler coming in for the Comets. Yaden looking for a second free throw. It's up and off the mark. Rebounded by Hillis. Hillis will bring the ball all the way up. Dieter has it to Rudd. Rudd's gonna drive. He's gonna charge. 
Stenson taking a charge there. Rudd's first, team fourth. 3.15 left in the first quarter. King's going to have to play it very clean if they don't want to start sending the Comets to the charity stripe with regularity. Zyder brings it up, gives it to Stenson to start the offense. Zyder has it. He'll pull up for three. Just a little long. Rebounded by Yaden. Yaden's going to drive kick. Craig, three. Off the mark. To be out off of LJ Hillis as Klinger wraps around to swat it back at him. Craig looks the inbound. He'll lob it into Stenson. Craig near side. Klinger. Stenson. Stenson dips, dumps it down low, and now Wade Taco is going to steal, but Klinger steals it back. Reverse layup puts it in for two. Great heads up play there by Klinger to know that Taco was about to fall out of bounds and just steal that ball. Well, that bucket brings it back to a three point game. Comets six, Kings nine. 218 in the first. Rudd has it far side. He'll dump it to Young. A lot of contact there, and it'll be a foul on Alex Craig. Craig picking up his second foul, team third. Got Gavin Molenkoff back in for the Comets. Trey Johnson back in for the Kings. Inbound into Johnson. He'll drive baseline. He'll give it to Hillis. Cross court pass. Rudd, shot fake. Jumper just in front of the elbow goes in for two. Stenson brings it down. He'll dump to Yaden. Yaden puts up a shot just a little long. Looks like it might have been tipped there by Young. Rudd drives baseline. He'll kick. Young, we're going to get another charge here. Lower the shoulder, and the ref sees it. You're getting it every time. That's Young second, team fifth. Yeah, refs definitely not letting these, these cast players get away with any kind of uh, offensive push. Yaden has it now. He'll give it to Klinger. Down low into Stenson. It's going to be a loose ball. Dieter saves it, gives it to Hillis. Hillis will bring it down quick. Molenkoff tried to come in and steal it. Stenson attip, attempted a backdoor pick, but... Couldn't quite get in there. Just over a minute remains in the first. Comets down by five now. Six Dieter. to 11. Dieter gives it to Young. Now into Hillis. Hillis, he'll get fouled as he goes up to shoot. Foul is on Caleb Stinson, his first. Team fourth. Hillis went two for two last time he's at the stripe. First one falls. Wayne Hook back in for the comments as we're under a minute to play. Hillis with his second. It's good. Stenson will bring it up. Comments down by seven. Hook has it near near corner. Stenson Zyder. 45 to go. Molenkoff has it at the elbow. He'll give it to Klinger. Klinger, three on the way. Just off the mark. Comets really struggling outside the arc tonight. 0 for 4 in the first quarter. And a couple of those have been pretty open looks. Johnson has it. He'll give it to Hillis. King's definitely looking for the last shot.
Hillis to Dieter. Dieter hands it off to Johnson. Young, Rudd drives, gives it to Young. Young, shot off the mark to be tipped. It's going to be out of bounds off of Rudd. At the end of one, it's cast and six. Lewis cast 13, come back for second quarter action on the IHSA Champions Network, brought to you by RTC TV4. Welcome back to Caston High School, where Lewis Cast has a seven point advantage, 13 to six over the Caston Comets, going into the second quarter. Summers brings the ball in. Molenkoff has it. He'll dump to Yaden at the elbow. Yaden to Molenkoff. Molenkoff sends it down low to Hook. It's going to be a tie up there as Hillis and Hook tie up with it. Arrow is going to go to the Kings. Johnson going to bring it up for the Kings. Lob pass into Hillis, Dieter, near side, back to Hillis. Hillis dumps down low to 44, Hook swats him. He's gonna get the rebound, Hook steals it. Hook tries to save it, Hillis gets the save. Molenkoff, he's gonna grab it. Hillis is gonna tie up with Molenkoff. That'll be Comet's ball now. A lot of athleticism on that play, recognition where the ball was and where it was going to be. Summers bringing the ball up. He'll pick up his dribble, send it to Hook, far side. Hook to Stinson. To Yaden. Yaden finds Stinson. Stinson lobbed to Yaden. Yaden puts the shot up. He's going to get fouled from behind. Foul there is on Trey Johnson, his first, team first. Yaden, first free throw up and good. Yaden. Second free throw up and good as well. Collins putting on pressure now. Hooks gets a steal there. Hook, stutter step, puts it in. There we go. Collins need to build some momentum here. Cotner Grace has it, dishes the Dieter to Young. No foul called there. Stenson drives. He's going to travel with it. Sometimes you get away with that. Sometimes you don't. Zyder enters for the comments. Comments in really soft pressure here. Johnson gives the Hillis near side. Back to Johnson. Far side to Rudd. Rudd dishes to Hillis. Hillis gets his pass tipped. Stenson pulls it away. Stenson to hook to Zyder. Zyder to Stenson. Stenson to Yaden. Zyder pump faked on a deep three there. He'll send a baseline. Tipped by the Kings, and that'll go out of bounds. Comets basketball still. Summers to inbound. He'll lob it deep into Zyder. Zyder gets it. He'll send to Yaden. Down low to Summers. Summers, cross court to Stinson, to Hook. 
Hook three. Ah, can't get it to fall. Hills gets the rebound. Great. Summers is going to foul him. Reed Summers picks up his first. Team first. Ten to thirteen, five thirty to play in the first half. Johnson will get the inbound. Rudd cross court. Dieter thought about a three there. He'll walk with it. He was pretty set on that three when the defense just charged him. Panicked there. Evans enters for the Comets. And we got Yaden down here tying his shoe, holding up the game. <laughs> Evans is going to bring it up for the Comets. Now will give it to Stenson. Stenson, Zyder, three. Boom, baby, from downtown Fulton. Zyder finally knocked the lid off from outside with that shot and tied up the game. Corner three by Dieter. That one's in. Stenson bringing it up quick. Evans, I kind of thought he double dribbled there. Evans has, or Stenson has it now. Near corner, Evans. Benson, Zyder, Yaden has it, Yaden gets his pass tip, Zyder pulls the pass down, Evans has it now, 420, pass down low into Yaden, Yaden dribbles, he's going to put a shot up and it's in. Yaden powering through the defense there to put that one in. Lots and lots of contact down low. Johnson gives the Cottner Graves. Now Rudd. Rudd dishes down low to Hillis. Hillis. Shot. No, he dishes the Johnson. Cross court to Rudd. To Graves in the corner. Cross court to Dieter. Dieter loses control of it. They'll give it to Hillis. Hillis will pull up for a three. And just a little long. Yaden pulls down the rebound. Now Stinson brings it down quick. He's going to drive all the way. That's and good. he puts it in. Comments with the fir their first lead of the game, I believe. 17-16 with 3.20 to play in the first half. Rudd, jumper. Just short. Yaden pulls down the rebound. We're going to have a foul here on Hillis. Yaden's other shoe comes untied now. <laughs> Hillis picks up his first, team second. Oh, he is going to double knot it this time. <laughs> and he'll take a seat. wonder if that has anything to do. Oh, now Hillis is tying his shoe. I need to get a towel out on the floor. See if there's something about the surface finish that's untying shoes. We're going to get a... Uh, Comets calling a 30 second timeout. Kings calling the timeout. All right, so they did. Our in house announcer said Comets. Well, you, you, he had other things to try and announce at the same time. Mr. Rinchler, we're going to just need just a little bit. No, I better not. Better not. Jeremy listens to these sometimes, and he does a great job. I, I wouldn't want him to beat me up and then quit announcing in house. No, yeah, no, he does a great job for us. Yeah. I don't think I'd want that job. Actually, I wouldn't. I don't <laughs> think I'd mind it. <laughs> it's, it's not so different than what you do here, Pete. I couldn't sound as stupid on there, though. Just at the three-minute mark, Comets with a one-point lead, 17-16, over the Kings here at home. Zyder, three. Boom, baby, from downtown 12 Mile. Make that four-point advantage, Comets. 
Comet's playing a tough defense, man to man. Molenkoff, Garden Johnson, Hillis looks to hand it off. He'll give it to Johnson near side. Johnson gives it back to Hillis. LJ Hillis with it. Rudd, Dieter, Johnson. Hillis loses it out of no, it's gonna get tipped out of bounds. Tipped out of bounds. King still with possession. Pete, I just got a notification. We really are in trouble. Jeremy's wife's listening at home. Oh, inbound to Rudd. That's in for two. That was a great inbound play. Cuts the Comets lead in half. Just over the two minute mark till we go into halftime. Smith with it. He'll dish it out to Stenson. Stenson powers through some contact. We're going to get a charge oh, here on Stenson. Great work by Dieter getting his seat set. His feet set. Really looked like Stinson got tripped on that drive. Well, I don't, I don't know about when he started driving, but definitely before there, I thought Hillis definitely got into him, but no call. A little bit of pressure here from Summers. Johnson dishes the Dieter near side Rudd. Rudd passes down low to Hillis. Be knocked out of Hillis' hand. Rudd pulls it in. Rudd gets tipped. Dieter. He's going to look for a man. He'll find Brody Hillis. Now to LJ Hillis. Now to Johnson to reset the offense. 90 seconds remain in the half. Down low into LJ Hillis. Cross court. Dieter three. That one's long. Hillis with the rebound. He'll put it in for two. Ties us up. Klinger. Summers. Gives it to Yaden. Yaden gets stripped. Now he'll go against Brody Hillis. He'll put that one in for two. Kings get the lead back. The minute to go in the first half. Klinger has it. He'll give it to Summers. Summers. Crossover, falls into Zyder's hands. Zyder gives it to Molenkoff. Molenkoff to Summers. Summers with 40 to go. He's gonna kick to Molenkoff. Molenkoff drives, kicks, Klinger. Klinger kicks, Summers three. Boom, baby from downtown Hoover. 23-22, Comets lead with 20 to go. Johnson definitely looking for the last shot of the half here. He's going to dump to Dieter. Dieter has it. He'll dump it down to Hillis. Hillis kicks out to Johnson. Johnson three. Just short. Cleaner gets the rebound. And that's going to be end of the half. Going into the locker room for halftime, we're 23 cast and 22 cast. We're gonna have some recognition of our young Comets here. I think what we're gonna do is just leave the camera on. We're gonna switch to some house audio and uh, we'll be back for a first half wrap up. You're watching Cast and Comets and Lewis Cast Kings basketball here on RTC TV4. So tonight we're gonna recognize all the youth basketball programs here at Caston. And first up, we're gonna start with the eighth grade boys. So eighth grade boys, if you come out. Got a whole bunch of teams tonight. Next up, we got the eighth grade girls. Still playing the game. Seventh grade boys. I'm assuming the seventh grade girls are not here. They are not here. So, sixth grade boys. Here we go. 
future of casting basketball. Looks like both teams have their starters back into the game. As we start off the second half, Johnson in, gets the inbound, gives it to Rudd. Back to Johnson. Rudd. Rudd's going to drive. Finds an open lane. Can't get it to fall. Molenkoff pulls down the rebound. Now Stenson will bring it up. Kicks the hook in the corner, and Hook takes a two steps before putting the ball on the ground. And if you didn't know, that is illegal. I believe that if Lewis Cass would have brought a student section, they would have reminded our players that you can't do that. Probably. Now, Brody Hills with it. Down to Rudd, into LJ Hills. That's going to be a foul on Yaden. Grant Yaden picks up his first, team first. Johnson inbounds the Dieter. Rudd has it. He'll drive. Pull up from the free throw line. Falls. Left wide open. Kings retake the lead less than a minute into the second half. Molenkoff dishes the Yaden. Yaden to Molenkoff. Down low into Hook. Hook. Layup. Good. Johnson. Bringing it up once again for the Kings. Gives it to Rudd. Over to Johnson. Brody Hillis to Rudd in the corner. Down to LJ Hillis. He's going to cross court. Johnson, Dieter to Hillis. Hillis, he's going to drive kick. Dieter, three. That one's long. Rebounded by Johnson, though. Now Brody Hillis has it. He's going to dump down low to LJ. LJ kicks. Johnson three. That one's off the mark. We're going to get a foul here. Looks like the official telling him to keep things sporting there. Zyder's going to get the... I thought he was calling a foul there to begin with, but he I, must, he must have decided too. that it was it was just, just a little rough. Zyder thinks about a three there. He'll dish it to Stenson. Stenson loses control of it. Now Molenkoff has it. Stenson at the volleyball line. Yaden has it. Back to Stenson. Stenson drives. Floater. That's in. 27-24 with two minutes gone in the third. Johnson picks up his dribble, gives it to Brody Hillis. Now Johnson down to LJ Hillis. He dumps it behind his back. Now Johnson gets it and puts it in for two. Great pass by LJ Hillis. Didn't quite find the right guy, but it did find a teammate. Looked like it was going to be a turnover there for just a second. It was bobbled. Oh, backdoor cut by Zyder. That's in for two. Great play there by the Comets. That one was definitely drawn up. As all plays are, I guess. <laughs> no, that wow. one absolutely looked like something right off the whiteboard. Like execution and everything. 
Dieter gives it to Hillis. Hillis, he's going to get fouled. Foul there on Molenkoff, his second, team second. LJ Hillis, 100% from the charity stripe tonight. First free throw is good. Craig enters and Young enters. Twenty nine twenty seven. Hillis looks to make it a one point ball game once again, and he will. Good shooters roll there. Put the right spin on it, and it fell. Hook in the corner, saves it, gives it to Zider. Stenson has it, top of the key. Zider dishes the Yaden. Yaden Zider. Zider tries to pass it down low, tipped. He's going to go out of bounds off of Hook. Good work by number three, Colton Young, or Bryce Rudd, getting in that passing lane, not allowing that ball get to the post. Yeah, I think if that pass would have connected, it was guaranteed two on the board. Young has it. He'll give it to Johnson. Johnson starting the offense. 2-3 zone by the Comets. He'll give it to Dieter. Back to Johnson. Near side. Rudd gives to Hillis. Rudd has it. Johnson to Rudd. Pass tipped. Young has it now. He's going to dump it to Johnson. Johnson drives, kicks. Dieter now. Back to Johnson. King's really working the ball around. Young passes Dieter. Three. Too long. To be saved by Yaden. Stenson bringing it up. He's going to drive, take it all the way. He puts it in for two. Very athletic, underhanded layup there. Kings get it across. Now Young has it. Far corner. He'll dump to Hillis. Hillis shot up and fouled once again by Yaden. Yaden picks up his second, team third. Once again, sending LJ Hillis to the line. He's got six of the Kings points from the free throw line tonight. Make that seven. Substitution, Carter Klingler checks in. Carter Klingler back in for the comments. Hillis looking to own almost a third of the Kings points from the stripe and he will. Okay, I guess it's closer to a quarter. Stenson brings it up, gives it to Craig. Yaden has it, Klinger with it. Klinger, Stenson, Zider. Zider gets it stripped, loose ball. It's gonna be a travel there as Hillis rolled over with the ball. Lucky break for the Comets there. 301 left in the third. Comets 31, Kings 30. Yeah, I am a little surprised by that call. A lot of times that won't get called because it wasn't, he didn't really fully roll with it. He just kind of turned, but uh, they called it that time. Stenson, spin move. He's going to get stripped. Hillis bringing it up quick. Hillis working against Yaden. Young near side, top of the key. Johnson resetting the offense. Dieter has it now. Corner three for Rudd. Wide open. That one falls. We're going to get a 30 second timeout here by Coach Davis. All right, we're going to step away. Say thank you to our sponsors. You're watching Cast of Comets Basketball on RTC TV4. Welcome back to Caston High School where Lewis Cass has just taken the lead for the first time since the second quarter. Lewis Cass 33, Caston 31. Caston's been down by as much as nine in this ball game before going on a tear in the second quarter. Craig has it, he'll dump to Yaden. 
Yaden finds Craig. Craig thought about a three. He'll drive. Shot fake. Puts it up. Can't get it to fall. Loose ball pulled down by Johnson. We're going to get a foul on Klinger trying to come from behind and steal it. Klinger picks up his first. Team four. Kings playing a very clean quarter of basketball. They don't have a single foul on the board. Johnson setting up the offense for the Kings. Rudd has it far side. Crossing the two minute mark here in the third. Hillis dumps down to Dieter. Dieter shot up and good. That was a great, great job by Hillis. Faking out the defense, finding Dieter down low. Craig with it, minute 45 to play in the third. Stenson gives the Zyder, back to Stenson. Back to Zyder, Klinger, top of the key. Craig has it. Stenson, gonna reset the offense here. Zyder, Klinger, back to Zyder. Klinger gets it, far side. Stenson now. Caleb looked a little frustrated that uh, his intended passing target didn't. We're going to get a foul on, on Dieter there. Dieter yeah. picks up his first, team first in the quarter as we have 68 seconds remaining. Definitely, definitely a lot of miscommunication there on the uh, side of some of uh, the comments. Craig looked like he was supposed to cut and he didn't. Stenson has it. Stinson's going to drive. Gets, gets blocked. Yaden goes up for the shot, and he's going to get fouled. Big block there by Hillis. Bryce Rudd picked up his second foul there. Team second. Yaden's first free throw is up, and good. A little bit of a shooter's roll there. Close as this game has been, everyone counts. And if you got to get it off a roll, get it off a roll. Yaden, second free throw up and good. Hook enters for Klinger. Thirty-three, thirty-five minute to go. Three for Rudd. Just a little short. Doesn't get it to roll in. Molikov has it. He can't find an open guy. He finds Zyder, top of the key. Zyder, he's going to dribble, kick, hook. Hook with 30. Comets might look for the last shot here. Yaden has it, top of the key. Passing the 22nd mark. Molenkoff with it. 15 to go. Hook. Stenson. We're at 10. Stenson has it. Two. Stenson puts up a shot. Off the off mark. Off the mark. It's going to run out of time. At the end of three, it's cast in 33. Lewis cast 35. We'll be back for fourth quarter action here on RTC TV4. And welcome to the fourth quarter here at the launching pad where the Comets are down by two to the Lewis cast Kings. 35-33 is the score. Eight minutes to play, eight timeouts remaining. Pete, this might be a long quarter of basketball. Yeah, a lot of, a lot of basketball to play. Barn burner here at the launching pad. Hook has it at the elbow. He'll kick Zyder deep three. Boom, baby, from downtown Hinpeck. That is how you start a quarter of basketball. That was that three was that was deep. And Brody, contested. Brody Hillis dumps the young, young drives. He'll kick to Johnson. LJ Hillis, top of the key. We're going to get an offensive foul here. Brody Hillis hits Stenson, and then Yaden trips over Stenson. Hillis picking up his third there. Team first. Team first. 
defense will meet Zyder at the timeline. Drop back into his own. Stenson, spin move, shot up, and can't get it to roll in. Molenkoff comes from behind, saves it, but it goes in the hands of Johnson. Great hustle there by Molenkoff. Dieter has it in the corner. Now Johnson. Johnson looks for somebody, finds Rudd. Rudd dishes back door. It's going to be out of bounds off of Molenkoff as he gets a hand on Dieter dribbling out of there. Great effort to get into that passing lane. Molenkoff came from clear across the court for that. Young to Hillis. Hillis, he's going to drive. He's going to get fouled there. Foul on Molenkoff, I believe. That'll be Molenkoff's third, team first. Again, Hillis, not the shooter you want to send to the line. He's the only king who's taken any, and he's 100%. And he's going to maintain that average. Rudd enters for the Kings, and Smith enters for the Comets. 36-36. Hillis most likely going to take the lead with this free throw. He does. Can't argue with the results like that, Pete. Not at all. Now Stenson brings it up for the Comets. He'll dish it to Zyder. Zyder, another three. Just off the mark. Hillis gets the rebound. Heavily contested once again. A little bit more than the last one. Hillis finds Young, or Rudd, sorry. Now, now Young has it. He'll dribble out, give it to Johnson. Johnson finds LJ Hillis. Back to Johnson. Young drives, kicks out Johnson. Rudd. Good defensive reads there, not to, not to. Rudd tries to dish to Hillis. Loose ball, Smith knocks it in the hands of Johnson. Now Hillis drives, puts that one in for two. Stenson bringing it up for the Comets with 5.38 to go. Drives, kicks to Zyder. Zyder spin move. Gives it to Stenson. Stenson three. Just off. Johnson gets the rebound. He'll kick it up to Brody Hillis. Back to Johnson. LJ near side. Thought about a three there. He's going to drill around, hand it off to Johnson. Trey Johnson starting the offense off here. Five minutes left on the clock. Hillis had an open look there. He drives, puts up a jump shot, and that one's in. We're going to get a timeout by Lewis Cass. Full timeout. Well, with that, we're going to step away, say thank you to our sponsors. You're watching Cast and Comments Basketball on RTC TV4. All right, as that timeout expires, Kasten now quickly down by five with 4.58 left in the fourth. Stenson brings it up. Gives it to Hook, far side. Craig back to Hook. Hook finds Zyder, heavily contended there by Trey Johnson. Now Stinson has it. He'll dump it down to Yaden. Back to Stinson. Zyder near side. Dishes to Yaden. Yaden gets stripped. He's going to find Stinson. Stinson mishandles the pass, but he'll retain possession. Yaden has it. Craig three. Just to the right. Hillis with it now. He's going to get trapped. He'll run the sideline. He's going to be tipped out of bounds by Zyder. Half of the fourth remains. Comets absolutely have to keep their head in the game. They can't get frustrated. They can't get sped up, and they got to play the game just at their speed. Johnson has it. He'll drive, kick. Young drives himself, kicks it to Hillis. 
Hillis finds an open Johnson. Brody Hillis now with it. He's going to kick Johnson up top. Young thought about three there. Won't take it. He'll kick to Brody Hillis near corner. Drives. No call on that. I saw the ref shaking his head. Gets swatted by Hook. Good read by Hook not to go up before it was time. Now Hook has it. Now Stenson. Yaden. Stenson. Stenson dribbles off of Hillis' foot. He's going to get it tipped now. Sends it to Craig down low. Back to Stenson. Three. Just off. Brody Hillis gets the rebound. Gives it to LJ. Kings with 2.48 to go. Up by five. 41-36. We're going to get a carry. Lewis Cass fans not happy with that call. Hill is kind of uh, kind of getting a little attitude with the ref there. He was not happy about the call. He calmed down though before the ref teed him up. Klinger with the inbound. Stenson's going to have it. Near side to Zyder. Yaden. Stenson. Zyder in the corner. Three on the way. Just off the mark once again. Klinger gets the rebound though. Drives, kicks, Yaden. Stenson with it to Klinger. Hook has it. Hook sends it to Yaden. Yaden finds Stenson. Stenson floater doesn't get the roll. Rudd pulls down the rebound. So many near misses over here for the Comets. We get a full timeout by Lewis Gass. Lewis Gass Kings call a full timeout. All right, well, we'll be back in 60 seconds then. You're watching Cast and Comets Basketball on RTC TV4. Welcome back to the launching pad. Just under two minutes remain on the clock. Comets looking at a five-point deficit, 36-41. Just haven't been able to find the bottom of the bucket to speak of here in this fourth quarter. Hillis sends it down to Rudd. Rudd gets fouled by Klinger going up for the shot. Klinger using a second foul there. Team second. Comments lucky Rudd didn't just put that in for two to begin with. First free throw up and good. Brody Hillis and Lane Hook enter the game. Second free throw is good. 43-36. Stenson has it. Dishes the Yaden high pass. Yaden. Puts it up and draws the foul. Can't get the shot to roll in. Foul there on Colton Young, his third. Team second. Yaden, the only common who shot free throws tonight. First one is off the mark. Molenkoff and Dieter enter into the game. Minute 32, 36-43, Lewis Cass leads. And here's the second free throw up and off of the mark. Stenson with the rebound, he puts it in for two. We're going to get a timeout here by Coach Davis, a 30-second timeout. All right, folks, you know the drill. We'll be back in 30 seconds. You're watching Cast of Comets Basketball, RTC TV4. Welcome back. Ladies and gentlemen, 90 seconds on the clock. Comets down by five just before the break. Fantastic heads up by Stenson to grab the rebound off of a missed free throw. 
put it in for two. Long Hill. pass ahead. Hillis with it. He'll kick out to Johnson. Hillis in the corner. He's going to dribble out. Back to Johnson. Comet's got to extend the zone. Come out and meet him. And there is no time to let them hold. Uh, that's going to be a foul on Yaden and trying to swat the ball. I think that was a smartly used foul there. His third, team third. Comet still got one to give. Unfortunately, Lewis Cash shooting 100% from the charity stripe tonight. It's almost like there's nobody to send to the line. Long inbound to Dieter. Comet's aggressive trap defense. Brody Hillis trapped in the corner. We're going to get a timeout here by the Kings. One 30 two, it's out. a 30. We're going to go ahead and keep that here. Really, Coach uh, Lewis Cass coach didn't have any option but to burn a timeout there or give up possession. We're under a minute, five-point game. Definitely it, still, I mean, they can, Comets can still come back from it, but they, they have to, have to stop the Kings here. Yeah, if, I think if the Kings score, it's all but over. It's definitely, definitely going to be harder for the Comets to come back. You know, that makes it a... Especially with the the shooting percentage. The, the Comets have just had some struggles here in this fourth quarter. It does look like uh, our seventh and eighth grade girls basketball teams back from their game, and I see a couple of fresh trophies in their hands. We're going to get a foul on Klinger here as Hillis gets the ball. Klinger's third, team fourth. That's the last of the free ones. Inbound into Brody Hillis. He'll drive, put that one up, and it rolls in for two. Lewis Cass has had all the luck here tonight with that shooter's roll. We're going to get a foul on LJ Hillis here as Klinger drove and kicked it out. That'll be Hillis's second, team third. 43 seconds remain in this seven point game. Evans enters into the ball game. Comets have to move this ball, 39 seconds. Evans, corner three. Boom, baby, from downtown Niona Lake. Comets using a full timeout. We're going to step away and say thank you to our sponsors. You're watching Cast Comets Basketball, RTC TV4. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Comets obviously in a full court press. There are no options right now. Down by four, 34.9 seconds left on the clock. Hillis inbounds the Dieter. Now Hillis. Can't send Hillis to the line, that's for sure. Sends it to Brody Hillis. Down to Rudd. Rudd pulls Why it out. Smart play. Why would Rudd have not gone vertical with that? Uh, at this point, wasting time off the clock is better, especially if you're shooting this good from free throw from the line like they are. Klingler picks up his fourth, team fifth. First free throw is up and in. 41-46 now. That ball looked like it rolled from underneath the rim and went up and over. I'm telling you, Lewis Cass has had all of the shooters' rolls here tonight. And Pete, I'm afraid. 24-2 to play, five-point lead. One more, one more free throw to put if, up. If they get if they get to seven, I'd say it's over. But six is still doable. I, mean, I think Coach, that's the nail in the coffin. Coach Davis has two timeouts still. Hit a three here. Stinson drives, puts up a right-handed layup. That one's in. We get another timeout. Well, well, I saw him gesture what full we got? and say 30. We, we got to know what we got. Full timeout. All right, another full timeout. We're going to step away, say thank you, pay some bills. Stay tuned, ladies and gentlemen. 
Ah. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. 16.8 left on the clock. Four point uh, advantage, Lewis Cass Kings. Inbound to Johnson. He's gonna get trapped. Pass to Dieter, it's gonna be a foul on Craig. Probably a good thing that he fouled there because uh, there was two cast players wide open down low. I mean, you could have hit them with anything. They were wide open. Dieter to the line to shoot two. He's not been at the free throw line, but he's 50% everywhere else on the floor tonight. And he's 100% from the line. That might just do it here. 48-43, five-point lead. It's still doable, but, you know, Michael Jordan scored uh, 11 and, <laughs> or no, he scored nine and 11 seconds, but uh, I don't think we got Michael Jordan on the court. Second free throw is off. Hey, that's the first free throw missed of the night by the Kings. Comments did it get it down quick. Zyder shot up. Just off. That's probably going to end it here. Yeah, Hills is going to hold it out to end the ball game. All right, your final here from Caston High School. Lewis Cast 48. Caston Comets 43. We're going to step away, tally up some stats for the game. We'll wait to speak to Coach Carl Davis. You've been watching Caston Comets basketball on RTC TV 4.